I'm not sure if we're digging a well or setting a septic system. Look at all this water. What's up, everybody? This is Brian over here at the Little Orchard Farm, and I want to welcome you to today's video. Uh, we are back out on the farm uh, late in the week. Uh, we've got uh, uh, we've got our septic system being implemented today, and so uh, Wade and his team they're going to be bringing down the big, huge plastic uh, container. We're going to bury it on the other end of the cabin. Uh, that's where the engineer, uh, the septic, or the, uh, yeah, I guess it's a septic engineer, um, uh, came out and did his work uh, several months ago and, uh, and, and identified that as being the area um, uh, that, uh, uh, number one, that, that was most convenient for us and two, that the land perked and, and did all that it was supposed to do. So, so his team's going to uh, be out here today uh, in implementing that system. I'm not sure if we're digging a well or setting a septic system. Look at all this water. All right, so uh, Wade and his team, they have dug the hole. Uh, we do have an issue. There is water quickly filling up our hole. Uh, and that presents a problem because as uh, you were just seeing on the tank, and this is a thousand gallon uh, tank, um, you've got to have weight to hold it down. Otherwise, even if you put dirt on top of it, that thing will pop up like a fishing bobber. So, um, so we're going to have to probably drain some of this water out. We have put a um a pump over at the creek and we're going to pull water into the tank when we get it in but i'm thinking we're probably going to have to uh, uh, initially start with putting the pump in here and pumping some of this water out uh, but eventually he'll set the tank off into the hole and uh, we will fill that tank up with water and then he's gonna um uh he's gonna dig out the trench lines the field lines for it um uh, we're using the uh the half shell hard uh plastic ribbed field lines instead of the old school old style pvc or whatever they were using back then these are the new ones so these aren't going to go out near as far um but uh but yeah so that's kind of where we are um a lot of rain a lot of rain over the last couple of weeks and so that's obviously evident as when he dug down five feet um Man, we ran into a lot of water. That's a problem. Big problem.
All right, so the material that they're putting down is called low pro chambers, and, uh, and they've got the end cap down here on the very end. But essentially what they do uh, is they interlock these. There's a little locking mechanism on each end of them. And so they just snap them together. All right, so Wade's covering up the uh, the chambering line, the chambering field, um, and the guys guys over here in the ditch are getting the exit line, uh, the outlet line coming out of the septic tank and into the chambering field, and so they're finishing that up. And then we've got to install an inlet T and an outlet T, and the outlet T is going to have a filter to it. And I'll show you that. Uh, uh, here in just a few minutes. But yeah, they're going to get all this uh, covered up now and start smoothing out. Start smoothing everything out, grading it out for me. So here's the filter for the septic system. Big plastic. Supposedly supposed to be uh, replaced every couple of years, I think. Or at least taken out and cleaned out. Just taken out and cleaned. Cleaned out. And that is uh, that is going into a outlet T that is just inside the tank here. Thank you. Yep. And then on the, in, on the inlet side, there'll also be another, be another piece of pipe coming in and connecting to the inlet T which is right there. Right, so these guys are going to install a T on the inlet side and that's the clean out valve. And so they're going to put that on the top side of the T and then I will I will bring the um, the wastewater line from the house and connect it to what he is uh, installing right there. Well, and just like that, Wade and, and his two workers, TJ and Jose, uh, done. Got our septic system buried, the uh, chambering field, the chamber line, the field lines uh, buried. He got out here and, uh, and he went to town on that bobcat and as you can tell, smoothed everything out really nice. A little soft and muddy. We still had a, a lot of water. Good grief, we've had a lot of rain. So everything's a little soft, but um, he was able to he was able to grade it out quite nicely. And uh, so whew, check that one off the list. Septic system done. Well, I guess that's going to wrap it up for this uh, for this little episode. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Got a little entertainment out of seeing the, uh, the septic system go in. Hang around, come back and see the next one. And until next time, you guys be safe and have a wonderful week. We will see ya.